welcome to Lynn Lodge Tara. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a reading, a weekly reading for Scorpio for this week in November 2021. Please keep in mind that these readings are very general, so take what resonates through the rest. Not every reading will be for you, not every reading will be about your situation. Um, please also keep in mind that everything is subject to free will, your free will, and anyone or anything that you are energetically connected to is free will, okay? So... With that being said, I have made some little prototype, little decks, little oracle decks. I want to check your check your love and your money, okay? And then I'll pull tarot and other cards too, okay? So let's see. One second. Let me make sure I don't lose these rubber bands. Let's see. What's going on for Scorpio and love? Let's just get an overall love message for Scorpio, please. Okay, thank you. Okay, well, boom, there you go. There's a third party. Now, third party does not necessarily have to be romantic. A third party could be anything that, anything or anyone, family, friends, coworkers, yes, and love interest, um, past, current, or in the future, that uh, it can even be like playing video games too much. Okay, that could get in between a connection. But there is a third party here. There is something that's coming between you and your partner if you are, um, with someone if you are single then be mindful of you someone coming into your life that you meeting someone new that might actually already be involved with someone okay so keep that in mind please all right let's see let me let's look at your money okay what's going on for money okay so you might have to travel for work or for your finances here anything else please for overall money Okay, money hungry. So someone could see you as money hungry, or you could see someone else as money hungry. But there is travel involved, okay, for some type of business deal. Anything else for Scorpio's money? Ah, bankruptcy. Be mindful, okay. Be mindful of bankruptcies, okay. Or you you know what I mean. Or people who are going through the whole process of bankruptcy. Um, they might be money hungry. Okay, or be careful of people accusing you of that. If that's not you, that's not your story, that's not your story. Now, there are some Scorpios out there that may actually be this, okay? So, also keep that in mind. Just watch your spending and your travel, okay? Um, please. Also, watch any greed tendencies, okay? That'll be really important for you. All right, let's see. All right, I don't know. They want me to get a timing. Now, I did make a little time deck because, you know, as you guys know, Spirit doesn't really like to give me a time. Um, I do put the November 2021 on there for organizational purposes, but it really could be any time that you see the reading, it could apply to you. But let's see. Is there a time frame or any timing by your next birthday? So you are in Scorpio season and something happened in August. By your next birthday, you're about to find something so... If your birthday's already passed, then and you didn't find out anything new about August of of uh, this past year, so past August that we just you know over the summer, then this message isn't for you. But if your birthday hasn't happened yet, and by your next birthday, so Scorpio season, so you're gonna find out about something that had happened in August, or you're gonna find something out about a Leo. Okay, so keep that in mind. So there's your timing stuff. Let's see. Now let's get into some tarot. Alright. What's going on for my Scorpios, please, this week? This week. November. Uh, this week in November 2021 for my Scorpios, please. Sun, moon, rising. What's going on for my Scorpios, please, this week? What's going on for my Scorpios this week, please? Spirit. Okay. High Priestess in reverse. Why are you not listening to your intuition, Scorpio? Ten of Cups in reverse. You're not listening to your intuition to leave a situation. Okay. Tower reverse. Queen of Cups reverse. Chariot. You are trying to avoid a disaster here. I feel like, now this could be you or someone else here, but this is 
Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces for me. This is a secret being revealed about a water sign of Cancer, Pisces possibly, or about you. Um, that's going to cause somebody here to leave. This is also your card, the tower. Why are you... This is like total break of a situation here. Total uh, foundation ruin. This also can talk about trying to avoid a disaster, but not being able to. Now, this could be you. could be someone else. You could also be dealing with a Cancer, an Aries, a Leo, or a Taurus. So what what is this about? Uh, you're not listening. You're blocking out your intuition. You might even be... I, okay, Scorpio, I gotta call your ass out, okay? You can be mad at me all the fuck you want in the comments, but I gotta call you out. You're not listening to your intuition and you're being manipulative. Yep, I gotta call you out. In order to avoid, to avoid something. Gotta call you out, Scorpio. And I call the other ones out. I gotta call it as I see it. Why are you manipulating someone? Okay, high priestess reverse, please. Yeah, secrets are about to be revealed about you or Cancer or Pisces, but you're manipulating a situation. Show me in order to get something, okay, for a Pentacles reverse. You're letting go of a family dynamic here. Show me the Tower reverse. Ooh, three of swords. You feel betrayed or you have betrayed someone. Could also be Aries as well. Seven of Pentacles here. You're manipulating somebody to invest in you only for you to turn around and leave. Why? Why are you doing that? That's stupid. That's that's creating karma, reaping what you sow, right? I mean, why are you doing that? All right, show me the chariot, please. Is this a revenge thing? Is this a revenge? Is, is this a sting? Okay, show me the chariot, please. Be careful with that. I mean, hey, you're Scorpio. I know you guys, you know, got that fucking stinger. But here's the deal: you're going within, and you're deciding to leave. But what you're doing is you're creating a, a relational or karmic debt as you do so. That will eventually have to be paid back to you. Because you're the one who's creating it. So, might want to watch that damn stinger a little bit, Scorpio. Because you might just get stung back in a way that you don't like. Remember, we had money hungry and we had bankruptcy, travel. We also had third party. So, be careful with this manipulation here about investments. Also, manipulating money. Okay, you also could be out of pocket about your emotions about an investment return on investment here but I, I, you're not going to get it possibly with a virgo here i don't think you're going to get it because i think it feels like you're playing some game also you could be dealing with a capricorn you're playing some type of game with somebody i mean i gotta call it i gotta call it scorpio i mean if you're doing one you're doing some shicey shit i'm gonna call your ass out right let's see all right let me see what who who is scorpio dealing with please who could Scorpio possibly be dealing with outside of those signs? Any additional signs? A Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising. A Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising. I'm playing a game with somebody's head. I don't like it, Scorpio. A water sign, so Scorpio Pisces. There's a Virgo at the center of this shit, though. You could even be dealing with an Aries, possibly. Some in rising, but it doesn't have to be. There is a Virgo at the center of this shit, though. <clears throat> Let's see. So if you're dealing with a Cancer, what is Cancer's intentions towards you? They're lying to you. Or you're lying to them. Someone's lying about being a widower here. Their fear of judgment here because they're, they might actually be married. Or you are, and you, your partner, is still alive and well. Show me this Virgo, please. Or someone lied, a widow lied, or a widower lied, and in order to get something out of probate as well. Okay, so we have the officer here. So this person might be like the official person here. Um, this person also might get a that might try to get you arrested. I don't know if you've done something to this person. Okay, someone has stole money. A Virgo stole money from you. Okay, child support money. A Virgo stole child support money or. Uh, a Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising has stole money from uh, your money for taxes for for a child, like your your you like you get a tax refund and shit. Okay, so if you're dealing with a Pisces, we got some money. This person oh got some money for you, owes you some money. They're thinking about this. They're thinking about the end of something, a way the way something ended. All right, Scorpio, 
this is about you. All right, cross watcher, dealing with Scorpio. What's Scorpio's intentions towards cross watcher? Well, they love you. Um, they do want to message you or communicate with you. They want to be happy with you. So this feels like a totally different set of Scorpios from, from the first part of the reading. Um, and lover, they, they love you. They want to be with you. But time is of the essence. Someone might be sick as well. Okay. All right. So there's that. Scorpio might be ill. If you, Scorpio, if you feel like you're not doing so good, you know, your health wise, please go see a doctor. Go get your checkups, please. All right. Let's see. Let me get you some guidance here on this thing. All right. Any guidance, please, for my Scorpios regarding this reading? Earth. You might be dealing with the Earth sign Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It says utilize logic, reason, and common sense. Don't get all up in your feels, Scorpio. Don't get all bent out of shape, okay? The king. You might be the one of Aries. <clears throat> Authority and diplomacy. Use, command your throne, okay? And use diplomacy. Be fair. Control. You Have emotional control over your emotions. Emotions are at their peak. So Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But you need to exert some type of emotional uh, control over yourself, Scorpio. Okay? Let's see. Don't get all out of pocket. Let's see. Anything else for guidance from my Scorpios, please, regarding this reading? Step out of your comfort zone. Use logic and common sense, not your emotions. Don't let, okay? Time to take action, new moon and Aries. You could very well be dealing with an Aries and then don't let the past hold, don't let past emotions hold you back anymore. Past traumas and upsets hold you back anymore. Take action with authority and diplomacy. Okay? Very well could be done with an Aries. And you step outside of your comfort zone and use more common sense and logic. Okay? Not saying you're not smart. I'm just saying you got to use that. There is there that logic shit is there for a reason. Okay? All right. All right, Scorpio. Well, this is what I have for you. I hope this helps. If you want to get a personal reading with me, that information will be in the description box below. Um, as well as my other social media, you know, my media, social media platforms. If you guys want to follow me there, sometimes I, I post stuff there too, different from YouTube, um, your written readings and things like that. Um, and memes. I love memes. Um, so you might have fun. I don't know. So, um, but yeah, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe and hit all notifications that way you know the next time I upload. And as always, Scorpio. Happy birthday and take care of yourself until next time.